have your dim bin so in this video i'll be showing you how to catch spikes okay efficiently okay. so you want to join us the link is in the description you can join us for free and we hope for more profit okay so first of all let's head on to the settings we are going to add the moving average of oscillator 12 26 9 apply to close black done then secondly you use a relative vigor index okay then 10 to pixel to green red then done okay so with this type of strategy i'm very sure you are not new to our group to my tele youtube channel so to make this trade let's say 98 percent efficient as i used to say and what i advise for any strategy make sure you know the direction of the market first okay so try switching to one hour four hours try look at what market is doing before you can take any trade maybe up in the morning try to check the direction of the market before taking any trade okay and this strategy if you've if you look at my previous video is also on catching spike if you can combine the two then i bet it will be very efficient for you guys okay so try checking my previous video not to catch spike if you can combine two of them i bet it will be efficient okay for you so let's add on to how we do it first of all okay i almost forgot before that we are going to add an our rsi this at level 85 and level 15. you can put it here that sell you can put here buy okay so you have a clearer picture of what it's saying so the strategy is very easy when the osma touches the um level 85 when one of the weak or tick touches level 85 is either you enter straight or you wait for the um relative vigor index to also touch it to to enter yourself okay so let's look for a uh, practical example you can see the tick of this osme touches the level 85 you can tick you can enter the trade as that yeah this year will have entered the trade and will have taken the um sell here yeah, wait for the 10 candles sorry after 10 candles you can see it spiked okay so the what you need to also take note is that don't put your stop loss too long okay do it too long too long your stop loss to be like between 20 to 20 between 20 to 30 candles depending on your um account okay and the lot size don't use big lot size a minimal lot size and i assure you that for every 10 trade you take about it about seven or eight will be in profit and the remaining two or three will be in loss and if you do this every day <clears throat> I bet you will see changes in your account okay so you wait for it to touch um the level 85 yeah then you can enter your sell or you wait for the rvi to touch it too so if you are the one that you want to be patient when the week touches level 85 you wait for the rvi to touch it too before you can take your trade for a sale okay this is not just from something this um osme react to our price uh moves okay so it will be good because there are some level price cannot just buy all the time like cannot just move one dash all the time okay this indicator try to you know show maybe at the peak the peak of where markets can reach okay 
So I told not is hundred percent. This is a ninety eight percent strategy. Okay. So let's see. And don't forget check the direction of the market. Now look at this example. You can see the week touches. And if you are to enter here, you can see it's moved. So to be safe or to be guided, wait for the RVI. Okay, to also touch the level eight five after reaching here. So that you'll be like, okay, I think price is set. So you can see when the RVI touches it, yeah. And you can see as price is in, within 10 to 15 candle, it's spiked, okay. And don't forget, sorry, I forgot to mention, you only use it on a five minute time frame, okay. Use it on a five minute time frame. It doesn't work on a one minute time frame. I've checked it out. Use it on a five minute time frame, okay. And I assure you, it will be nice. Okay, so let's check on upon 1,000. Don't forget, make sure you subscribe or share. And if you want to, you can comment on what you want me to do next, the video you want me to create next, so that, I mean, I can satisfy your needs. Okay, so look at, look at the practical example. You can see here. It touches the week this week of the osma the first week touches level 15 which signifies a buy okay and as you can see if you have to wait for the rvi if you have to wait for it you can see it's piled before the rvi can touch it so this is also a 50 50 is either you um wait for the rvi or you don't wait okay so you know you just have to like consider okay if you have to wait for it but if you have to wait for the rvi to touch it it will be beneficial to you or you have more instead of you waiting waiting it'll be fast the spike will come faster okay and i think this is nice and as you can see let's look at an example okay you can see here the first week touches here okay and as you can see if you have to wait if if you have to enter there you can see price moved price wasted um a lot of time before giving the spike so you can see price the rvi touches the level 15 here and as you can see between um 15 candles is spiked okay another thing I want to say or to consider if you see market made two spike okay two spikes is either you close it or you put stop loss at your entry okay this is just a fast spike strategy okay the type of spikes signal I give in groups okay all those ones are like give signal okay those ones are long term trade this one that can run for one hour is different from this type of strategy okay the ones i give in the telegram channel is different that you can hold for like one hour 30 minutes those ones are different okay this is a um short term spike strategy and the one i give in signals is a long term trade spike such um signal okay so don't say that because i hold tr my trade for one hour it seems that okay let me to hold this okay no okay just wait for two to three spikes then close the market don't be greedy don't be don't waste time in the market okay the market is not on your side especially on lower time frames if you are trading on lower time frames anything can happen especially if you are doing scalping scalping is somewhat risky okay but because in scalping you cannot close if you are like in spike you can you don't have control when to close and when not to close but, but in scalping if you make like one two three four spikes you can make eight spikes your account is gone okay so just be careful with the way you trade okay and as you can see here please please don't forget know the direction of the market with your eye you can see that this is an uptrend this is an uptrend in boom 500 so you should be looking at okay this is the best time to take spikes okay you can see the week first week touches the level 15 yeah when it touches it you can see it's after some time then 
a spiked but before it spikes you can see that the rv height also touches it when it touches the then the osme touches level 15 we we'll wait for the rvi to touch it also when it touches it then you can now wait for your spike you can put stop loss maybe 20 candles and you can see this long spike okay i've told you if you make two spikes if the profit is little to you try putting stop loss maybe at your entry okay and don't say because profit is little if you make two dollars for every two two dollars it can be accumulating and you can make ten dollars from it okay so don't be greedy don't be like saying um you want to make quick money okay don't have that mentality this is crash 500 in crash 500 we sell this i'm um, touches level 85 we are with you can see if i had to wait it took some time if i had to enter straight as it touches level 85 it took like 20 minutes before it spiked, so we will not be looking to that. Our advice you always wait for the RVI to touch it. When, when the RVI touches it, you can see between 10 candles it spiked. Okay, this long spike does not happen every time. Okay, if you are lucky, you can catch all of this. Okay, this type of spike is this type of spike signal I give in groups in my Telegram channel. Okay, this is a type of signal give long and trace signal okay but if you're lucky you can also catch this type of spice with this strategy just put soft loss and let it run okay um i hope you guys have understood this strategy okay if you have any questions um, message in the um box down below okay you can um message me on telegram join our group make sure you subscribe and more videos coming guys this is just to make you have the knowledge okay on spike trading okay make you guys should test it out and tell me what you think of it okay and tell me what you have think of this strategy okay thank you guys for watching